Hello guys, this is Vaish. So today, Saturday is uh, July 22 editorial. Uh, so today actually there is nothing to discuss. Today's day you can consider as a free day. Usually Sunday is the day when there is no editorials. I'll tell you, I'll tell you the articles like why we are telling it's free day, why uh, it is not worth discussing. Either it is repeat or it is uh, not at all useful for UPSC exam. Okay, so clear cut understanding you will have. Uh, so it's a free day. Okay, so you can use this today like if something was missed any previous episode, you can do today okay this one in 10 minutes i'll wind up and then you can do the episode which you missed or you can watch the plum series you can start watching lectures if you are enrolled to my test series you already know what to do you have to watch uh, the ncrt lectures and spectrum lectures today so like that every day there is a target for you others who have not enrolled you can do whatever okay so but don't waste the time and think it's free tomorrow also no editorial next editorial will be on monday only okay so today's articles if you see and one more point this should you join coaching class this repeatedly i'm getting uh, queries okay even after we have answered it in the foundation you instead of watching the foundation which is given you are liking to ask this again in person so this also i'll tell you uh, in some time i'll tell you so today's articles i'll tell you one is local news uh, gujarat uh, uh, this uh, one activist related case it already came two three times in the paper until again keep coming but it's so uh, detailing about the bail and not getting bail and this gujarat bjp 2002 full that kind of issues that it is nothing worth discussing for upsc exam so that we won't discuss and today nothing we'll discuss in fact this is ground zero you know the saturday second page will be ground zero monday to friday it will be an opinion page where good articles comes but in saturday it is ground zero so we anyway won't discuss then here manipur issue two articles one is politics bjp's uh, thing and another is the like uh, like you handled uh, Kashmir issue, do internet ban and the such things. Author is telling such a thing won't save Manipur. That is not enough. Again, full blame game and this thing going on. So Manipur, anyway, you don't think like we didn't cover. Already I discussed in one of the editorial, I told you the core issue why they are fighting. The valley people, the Metis and the hill area, uh, Kuki people, they are fighting. One is Hindus, one is Christians. It's not a religious fight. They are fighting for land and this uh, tribal rights and all these things. So this Manipur violence, especially ma'am has made a video, 15 minute video. It is uploaded today. So that you should watch today. So we'll get a full idea of why they are fighting and what is the history and future of it. Okay. Then this uh, particular article which is a big article which you see, publisher platform imbalances need fixing. Some points. Uh, I will tell you this article is about the news publisher okay the news channels versus the digital platforms now I know most of the things even including the Manipur uh, latest that issue you did not watch it in a news you saw it in the social media so social media is covering 99% of the news now and they are taking it from where they're taking it from some newspapers or these people only who covered it news reporters or journalists so these people are not paying anything properly to them there is no transparency or maybe suppose the news comes uh, about uh, something which Facebook has done wrong. Do you think Facebook will uh, publish that in their platforms? It will not be there in Facebook or Instagram. You will find it in some other platform. Okay. So that transparency and money issue or that fight between uh, news publisher versus platform, that big essay that author has written. But I felt only these two points important, the points of contention. One is fair valuation, which is the matter of compensation or money. And enumerative accountability meaning as i told transparency are they actually what news news shows or the actual news coverage which is journalist is it what they are showing or the social media is tweaking it as per their convenience and making small shots out of it and then uh, doing it for their publicity that two points are discussed in detail in this other than that that article as such i didn't feel important because they are discussing the different laws of different country like united states have this particular act uh, south africa has this act europe has this act at least 15 countries law names and their uh, provisions is written there which is of no use to you then india also they come at the end of the video they tell india's stand is very slow in this indian uh, government is not taking it seriously our department of electronics should uh, have a proper law drafted like other countries do and uh, we have a body called competition commission of india i told you already yesterday also so that is the body which looks into it that everything is fair in the market every companies are uh, like not uh, becoming a monopoly that and all is done by the competition uh, commission of india so they gave a case against google because uh, these two bodies in 2021 the digital news publisher association filed a plea against google okay they are like a group of people of news publishers and then 2022 the indian newspaper society ins they also filed a similar plea against google so cci took up the case and then uh, they uh, clubbed the investigations meaning both are anyway the same uh, people uh, same opposite party google so uh, club the investigation but that is like going on and on and on that case is going on uh, our ministries also sometimes will tell okay we should fight against this sometimes will tell no need to fight so it's fully complicated it's not reaching anywhere there is no conclusion in the article that's why i told today's articles are all worthless for upsc okay so that report also they after investigation a report came standing committee of finance in december 22 and uh, 
That report name was anti-competitive practices by big tech companies, meaning they are targeting Google or Facebook. And then uh, they echoed the concerns of, meaning they also in concerns and support with the DNP and INS, those two bodies, the report has come, but it has not reached anywhere. Okay, maybe we'll draft a new policy and all. We'll tell proper compensation should be there if you're using a news item and then uh, transparency should be there. So that kind of thing we may draft. So there is nothing outcome. This is the overall editorial today over. Okay, now that question which people are asking, should I join coaching class or not? Okay, because... I keep telling that everything is there in Vaishayas or everything is there in YouTube already. So that is a fact also. And this is exact thing as I told in foundation video number eight. Okay, 30 videos I'm giving. You please watch it one by one. Every question will be answered. Free of cost when you get that. 10, 10 days, 14 days you have to spend on my foundation. Then I'm telling you, you won't have any doubt in UPSC. So I'm not simply telling because it, we have done it. Okay, it is working since last two years. Okay, so that also another thing. Some people come and tell, so it's recorded in 21, 22 and all how it is worth now a complete exam pattern changed nothing has changed okay the same Lakshmikant you have to study same spectrum you have to study same NCRT you have to study everything is same only the question the way they frame the questions in the question paper that is changed syllabus topics everything is same okay nothing is going to change in UPSC for the next many years also nothing is going to change unless in the notification the syllabus or paper wise mark distribution some that and all is not changed last many years it is that and it will continue the same what your senior studies uh, studied since last five years that only you have to study but you have to practice more questions because they are making the question tougher because now as i told digitally everything is available every notebook textbooks everything is available online we people are also teaching 90 percent of the things free of cost in internet so you have everything by sitting at home so that is the reason i tell upsc also has no other option they have to make the exam tough because when everybody studies everything and come, then how will you eliminate people? UPSC is not a qualifying examination or selecting. It's a disqualifying examination, prelims I'm telling. They want to disqualify maximum people. Okay, because they need only that many people to go and write the mains. And then little bit people to go reach the interview. Because finally, how many? Thousand, thousand people will clear. So now the question, should you join coaching class? Many people should join coaching. So who are those people? They are the ones who will not wake up by themselves daily, who will not study daily. Who are, who are very lazy, who keeps uh, telling I'll do it tomorrow, I'll do it tomorrow. Such people should join coaching because then obviously it will be not, not in your hometown. You will obviously move to some at least nearest city uh, somewhere and then you have to go there, right? At least for the attendance, you have to go there. At least to show your parents who paid the fees, you have to go there. So when you daily, daily for that, like you went to school and college, automatically you will study, you will get a degree, right? In school and college, same way UPSC also something you will study. But if you are a person who already have the determination, already have the passion, you just need guidance like, okay, what all to study, which, which we are giving for free. That's what I'm telling in foundation. We are already telling what all to do. If you are ready to study yourself, that is my, my program also. I tell uh, one year self-study test series program, meaning you have to study yourself only because you are such people who don't need that classroom thing. Sit in a classroom and a hundred people are there. And then sometimes in TV screen, I have to see because I'm very far away from the actual teacher. I can't even see them properly, the board. So some displays they would have kept. That's what happens in coaching classes now. You will be like in the big classroom, there are pillars inside the classroom. Do you know that some people are sitting behind the pillar? They can't even see the teacher. Okay, but there one panel, one display will be there and you see there. So it's like as if watching online class only. Okay, 90% of the people who tell I want coaching, I want teacher and all, they after reaching coaching class also never ask a single doubt to the teacher. They never go and separately meet the teacher, nothing they do. They are going and simply attending class and coming because parents told them to go. So if you actually our person who wants to ask doubts in person want to have a doubt session even after the class you want that physical interaction then you have to go for coaching coaching is not bad because this also is misinterpreted most of the times when i put status you would have seen in whatsapp it will be very harsh okay i would have i would be telling very like if you need sweet talks if you need buttering kind of thing and all you are at the wrong place go to some other coaching so here when i'm telling i'm telling about vaisha is that me doesn't mean I'm mocking all the coaching because this I have got messages from people. Why are you mocking all the coaching classes? You go and watch this foundation video, video number eight. I have told you should go to coaching. If you are a category of persons who actually won't study anything yourself, you have to go for coaching. They'll give you the printed materials. They'll make you write mock test. Everything you are there in house, you are learning. Okay. But if you are okay in studying everything online or uh, through virtual modes, then you only need to join test series because test series, as I told, the question pattern is becoming tougher and tougher. So that you cannot do self-study. You need someone who is more experienced than you to give you that kind of questions where you make mistakes. Okay, everything is easy means then like you download previous year question paper, question is there, answer is there, done. That is not enough. Like we will set tough questions to you in prelims. So when you keep practicing that entire year, by the end when you reach the exam hall, actual exam hall, you will see I have even solved even tougher questions than this. So UPSC will look simple to you. Okay, mains also, mains you need evaluation. 
you have to write then you will make mistakes obviously we ask something you will write something else it happens most of the time when i correct papers i have seen question is what something else you have written something else i strike it completely and i put zero zero out of 15 because that is what upsc will do when you get that strict evaluation on the first week itself that time second week onwards you will read the question more carefully okay but if you are doing in your home alone by yourself self evaluation you will not realize you are writing wrong answer still you don't realize according to you have written the best answer or maybe you two friends are sitting together and evaluating each other's paper unless you are veteran students or 2 3 years of experience you have in mains and all you don't know what time correcting you just feel or to make your friend happy you will put okay 8 out of 10 10 out of 10 upsc won't give you such marks you have seen the marks of toppers the toppers gets 50 percentage marks 2025 is the total uh, marks i think for prelims plus mains sorry prelims is not there mains plus interview in that uh, around 1750 is mains so in that 1050 people are getting 900 or 1000 they're getting 50 percent marks only the rank ones marks is that much upsc will give you that much only you write a big two page thing thinking you have written a brilliant answer they will put 5 out of 15 and that is also good marks it's based on the question some questions will be there where very easy you will get around 11 out of 15 10 out of 15 and all else you will get only 4 marks 5 marks and all that is also good marks because everyone will be getting like that so you don't know these things you are still skill still in your school college mentality that i will buy hard this book i will go and write it they will give me 10 out of 10 not going to happen toppers mark is 50% okay so these things if you that's what if you don't know anything go and join coaching meaning you are not like you are so adamant that i will not watch vaishyas foundation i want coaching only go you have to go sit there and study okay for one year you study you will improve you will definitely improve but if you are okay in studying yourself then join only test series that also vaishyas test series is open join that if it's connecting with you because we give you a free mock first itself meaning i'll show you the sample first itself If you like that PDF kind of thing, again come and enroll the proper full course. Else, some other institute you like, you join. Else, two, three, four institute together you want to join, that also do. Because maximum practice you do, it's good for you. Because now studying, everybody are doing. It's about whether you can recollect and correct those answers. Because in prelims, your question and answer both are in front of you. You just have to choose. Still, you are failing. Okay, everybody are failing. So that trick, that how you solve questions, that skill will come when you practice more and more question. That elimination thing and all is gone now. So it's about reading the question, understanding, thinking in UPSC's angle. How would have they set an option? Would have they made second statement wrong or third, or did they purposely do this to confuse me? That you will get when you see more and more questions. So previous year questions plus one or two institutes test series. This is what you need if you are a self-study capable person. Not a self-study person. You are a lazy person. Go and join some coaching immediately. Okay. Then one year you will go like a school and discipline will come automatically. Okay. And try to join somewhere where. it is little bit strict at least there are many institutes which are very casual they are like you come if you want you go if you want we don't care we will send you materials anyway that much casually some places there means you will not improve because you were already lazy you went there those teachers are even more lazy you will end up wasting one year okay little bit teachers are strict and cares about your result and that passion should be there in their faces also when you talk to them then decide okay so this is it today's video i don't want to take more time Uh, you can whatsapp me and get the foundation if you have not yet done many people have got the foundation deleted it it's okay you come and ask again sir i deleted please give me okay i will give you the video again because many people are like they don't know they feel awkward to come and ask again okay don't feel that come and ask because one day you realize you have to study properly that day would be today so come and ask okay so this is the whatsapp number uh, instagram also please follow foundation is the first thing you have to start then if the series is there daily time table is there and second batch of 2024 will be announced uh, this week coming week and uh, 2025 two year plan also will be launched okay so wait for that so tomorrow also no editorial we'll see you on monday with the same thing okay so thank you and have a nice day